Yeah, hi there. I'm here in the Bürger Park in Bremen, so Citizen Park. Well, this park is is really huge. So, what we we have Sunday, so it is crowded. It is crowded. So, hope we are not disturbed by, I don't know, people making sports or. Bicycle riders or something like that. So I was searching for a quiet spot uh, because uh, there's a, a package arrived um, that was yesterday. Um, yesterday in the morning, uh, I went to the post office and I sent uh, a small package for uh, Smoky LA. So Smoky and I we we had we had a short chat uh, about. Belgium tobacco. So there's a special Belgium tobacco. I'm gonna to show you that. So and and we just yeah We just talked about that how it's done and the old traditional tobaccos and so on and He said well, I sent you something and um, Yeah, and so I, I packed my package and to send something in return. I, I went to the post yesterday in the morning uh, and yesterday in the afternoon uh, the package of Smokey arrived. Uh, well, that that was a great day, and um, I gotta show you that. So I I already uh, unpacked that, but I show you what is inside. So um, he sent me a traditional Belgium tobacco. So this is uh, done by Monsieur Manier. Uh, this is the uh, same one, and. Um, I'll show you the other side. Mm. There are different versions of that. So Smokey, he sent me this one. This is a medium cut uh, and this is a, a large cut. So it is not really a large cut, I'll show you that, but um, this is the largest cut they have. So I'll show you that on the other side. Yeah. And this is really a famous tobacco, and I have to admit, I didn't know that. I didn't know the tobacco at all, so I'm very happy to have this. So, Smokey, thank you very much. That's really kind. Uh, that, that's really uh, amazing. And he also sent me two to other samples, and um, yeah, that's, that's really great. Hope you enjoy uh, what I sent you. Uh, yeah. So and um, Smokey, he 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 not just sent me this. He visited Monsieur Manil um, in his tobacco company, if you can say that, because it's just one man, uh, yeah, who mixes the tobacco and is the tobacco blend master, Monsieur Manil. Uh, Monsieur Manil, he he said to him, uh, yeah. Don't, don't he don't want to have any more uh, publicity so don't do that <laughs> because I just I just can't uh, uh, produce all these tobaccos uh, they want from me so the, if I under if my understanding is right uh, of that was Smokey uh, told me uh, most of the tobacco well not most perhaps but a lot of uh, these uh, tobaccos uh, are produced for the US market. So, and then yesterday I just searched on Google uh, for that and I found, yeah, there are many reviews about the Samoa. So, I wondered that I, I haven't heard that before. So, yeah. And there is one review uh, of Briar Boy, I think. And I think there isn't. There isn't a lot of to add what, what, what he said. Um, that's a great uh, video. Have a look at that. So, uh, Briar Boy, if you see that, great video. And I think you, you absolutely hit the point uh, when it comes to the taste and everything. So, I can't tell you that. Um, so, I can show you the tobacco. It is. It is a burly. But it's a Belgian burley, so it has its uh, 
a special a taste and it comes very dry it's really absolutely dry and it's also dry when you smoke it and it's not easy to smoke so you have to go very gentle on that so um, you have to smoke it very cool so Smokey he told me uh, he doesn't really like it so it's it's, it's too harsh it's, it's bitey and so on and it is the moment you go too hot on it the moment you have a lack of concentration you just push it or something like that then it bites you um, it really gets harsh then so but if you smoke it uh, concentrate it if you smoke it like a cigar because it tastes like cigar leaves so then it provides really some good notes some cigar notes uh, reminds me uh, really of the Italian uh, cigars the Garibaldi cigars that you might have have seen in, in the old uh, Italy westerns, so uh, Italic westerns, um, and it reminds me of the Caporal, so the French traditional tobacco. I think uh, there are there are some similarities, but I'm going to test this because I I'm, I'm planning uh, to 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 make a short journey to France, and then I can test this. But if I remember correctly. There are some similarities to this uh, between these tobaccos, so I think it is an interesting smoke. It is a good smoke, I think, uh, if you like cigar leaves. So it's it's really cigar-like, and if you just sit down, you just have your pipe, you just concentrate on your pipe, you smoke it very very slowly, and then I think, yeah. I tried my first bowl yesterday and you know, I was skeptical because Smokey said, oh, well, that's very harsh and so on. But I have to say, well, yeah, that's, that's, it's really different and it's really just for someone who is into the natural tobaccos and who likes the, you know, the, the harder stuff, uh, <laughs> if you want to call it uh, that. So, yeah, Smokey. Thanks again. Uh, that's really kind, and uh, I don't know what to say. I just I just send you something. I hope you enjoy that. Oh, but this is really great. Uh, I'm gonna take this to the to the pipe club uh, on Tuesday, and yeah, I'm interested what uh, the pipe colleagues that what they say to this tobacco. So thanks again. Be well, um, and. Uh, all of you have a nice pipe, have a nice day, and perhaps see you again.